Thinking about making your own hose assemblies? Owning your own crimper decreases equipment downtime, lets you control expenses, and schedule your own hose repairs. Do you think that it's difficult to make your own custom hose assemblies? In this short video, we are going to show you how easy it is to make your own assemblies on our D165 hose crimper. Always remember the importance of safety. Work in a clean environment and with the proper safety equipment, such as goggles, gloves, and hearing protection. Your first step is to determine the length of hose you need for the project. Make sure your hose ends are cut square. You will also need the fittings to crimp onto the hose. Place the fitting above the hose to mark the hose end point. Mark the hose where you want to place the fittings. As a tip, remember the hose fittings slide best if the hose has been lubricated. Be certain the fitting is securely onto the hose. The crimping specifications can be found in our Discount Hydraulic Hose catalog or on our website www.discounthydraulichose.com. Once you have the hose fittings placed on the hose, it's important to check the correct micrometer setting. We are almost ready to crimp. Remember your safety gear and place the hose into the crimper. Line up the fittings mark with the top of the hose. Insert the compression ring into the crimper. Now you're ready to crimp. <laughs> Check the mark previously placed on the hose to make certain the fitting did not slip. To confirm you have crimped the correct size, measure the completed crimp. The portable D100 units are built into their own enclosures with storage space for extra dies, hose, and fittings. All D100 series machines accept the same color-coded dies.